I'm here today at Rotary Park where we spoke with Dave Rosima, 1984 World Series champion with the Detroit Tigers, who's in town this weekend to help raise money for the upkeep here at Rotary Field in conjunction with the Rotary Club of Chatham-Kent and, of course, to help out with the Chatham Minor Baseball Association. Now, Dave was in town today giving out autographs, and we spoke with him a little bit more about baseball and about the uh, fundraising efforts here today at Rotary Park. I'm here at Rotary Park today with Dave Rosima, a former Texas Ranger and, of course, Detroit Tiger World Series champion. How are you doing today? Real good. How are you today? I'm doing great. Now, what's brought you out here to uh, our Rotary Park today? Well, a few of my friends, they work for uh, Victoria Ford, and um, they said, Dave, come on out here, and um, I'd like to teach kids a little bit of baseball. So I threw a clinic earlier today, talked to some of the, the little leaguers in the park, and then um, signed some autographs, and people can come out here and test drive one of the, the Ford vehicles, um, which Ford said they would donate $20 per, per customer per drive for the Rotary Park here, because it's uh, for renovations and... It's a beautiful facility for the kids to play at, and you know, anytime you can raise a few mu a few bucks to take care of a few of the expenses, it's a it's a it's a good thing. Excellent. And uh, people have been coming out today to get uh, autographs. Do you mind if I get an autograph from you? You got it, buddy. Bro. All take right, excellent. I'm here today with Jason Chikowski, who is the treasurer of the Chatham Minor Baseball Association. How are you doing today, Jason? I'm great. How are you doing? I'm doing great. And we came out to Rotary Park here today for the event. Uh, maybe you could tell our viewers a little bit about what's going on here today at the park. Today we have the Drive One for Your Community uh, event uh, sponsored by Victory Ford. Um, it's an event to raise funds for the Chatham Rotary Club uh, as well as Chatham Minor Baseball for park improvements here at beautiful Rotary Park. Uh, we're lucky enough to, today to have 1984 World Series champion from the Detroit Tigers, Dave Rosima. Was out earlier playing uh, with the kids, uh, some little skills clinic and teaching the kids the finer points of pitching. Excellent. And uh, the proceeds today, you're going to be helping uh, with repairs and upkeep of uh, Rotary Park here? Yeah, absolutely. The uh, Chatham Rotary Club um, has taken ownership of this park for close to 70 years. Their names are all over this park and they've made a strong commitment to improving the grounds and the, and the facility uh, to the betterment of the kids of this community. And uh, just recently they've uh, made a $21,000 donation towards a warning track uh, for this baseball facility and, and funds uh, raised today for this drive event uh, will go be going towards that project. Excellent. Well, we want to thank uh, both the uh, Chatham Minor Baseball Association and the Rotary Club for their contribution back to the community here today. I, th I think he was. <laughs> what I'm going to put on here, go Tigers, you knew, you knew best team, <laughs> not the Jays. <laughs> Kidding. Now, back in 84, you were lucky enough to be World Series champions with the Detroit Tigers. Uh, now, maybe you could tell our viewers a little bit about what it was like to go to the World Series back then and how things have changed since 1984. Well, you know, back in 84, we were very fortunate to, uh, to actually be the champions of the world. It's, it's a big title, very gratifying title. Um, you know, we, we started off with 35 and 5, and for some reason, we just seemed like we had the, the, the nucleus of team, uh, pitching, hitting, uh, defense, that's the three key things you got to have to win a to win a World Series in the American League and to be a champion. So, and you know, so we were very, very, uh, very honored to have that role right there to win that. And I think today's times between like our time, our time, we had a lot of guys come to the minor leagues like Trammell, Whitaker, Morris, Gibson, myself. A lot of guys came through the minor league systems, Parish, and we de developed our team through then. And now it seems like today's ages are a lot of free agency coming in from everywhere. There seems like there's not a lot of homegrown. And it, it's very different because, you know, you bond with your players. Like in your leagues now these days, you bond with your players here. And then now in, in the professional sports, it seems like everybody's always going out, finding it, getting that free agent, that free agent, that free agent. So no one's really homegrown. And I think back in the day, we were homegrown and we bonded more together than from, from these days. And so it's it's changed. A lot of free agencies really made teams, and even the fans. The fans, they follow teams from the minor league system. They see these guys growing through, and they come up, and next, you know, they're gone. There's no none of this bondness through fans, through players, because it seemed like they trade them away all the time. So it, it has changed a little bit about baseball, but 
it's still a good game and a fun game, and it's a, it's a summer sport. So enjoy it and have fun at the games, too. So we're here today speaking with Jerry Bellinger, who's with the Rotary Club. Uh, maybe you could tell our viewers a little bit uh, about what's happening at the park here today. Okay. Today, uh, in conjunction with Ford, Ford is doing test drives, and they're donating money for every person who does the test drive. They're donating $20 to the Rotary Club. The Rotary Club is here because we have just donated $21,000 to uh, Minor Ball to put in a new warning track here at the uh, ballpark. Uh, you will also notice that we have a, a Mustang convertible here, and this is our 11th annual Mustang raffle, where we raffle off a, uh, a vintage Mustang uh, in order to raise funds which go back into the community, such as uh, we've committed a quarter of a million dollars to the new YMCA, 120 to the uh, Chatham-Kent uh, Hospital Alliance. Uh, we fund uh, student exchanges uh, worldwide. Uh, we do uh, bursaries for uh, universities and, and uh, colleges and a lot of work for, with senior citizens. And this is just one of the ways that we raise money to our numerous projects. Now, if uh, any of our viewers out there are interested in getting involved or getting their kids involved in the Chatham Minor Baseball Association, what do they need to do? Well, simply, they just have to get a hold of one of our executive members or they can call myself uh, or call the baseball office here. Uh, we've got close to 600 kids in our association this year. Uh, we're always looking for volunteers to help, uh, whether it be coaching, umpiring, um, just raking the fields, cutting grass, um, anything. So uh, they can get a hold of us and we'll definitely find them a job. Excellent. Well, we want to thank you for uh, putting on this event today and uh, giving back to the community and uh, uh, best of luck this year uh, on the field. Well, thanks for coming out. Appreciate that. No problem. Thanks. Well, well, it's excellent to see the, uh, the Rotary Club out here uh, helping give back to the community. If any of our viewers out there are interested in getting involved with the Rotary Club or some of your projects, um, what would you suggest uh, is the best method of action? Uh, well, we, there are actually two Rotary Clubs here in Chatham. There's the uh, Downtown Club, which meets uh, Wednesday at noon at the Capitol Theatre. And there's the Sunshine Club, which meets on Tuesday mornings, I believe it's 7.30, at Smitty's. And we'd be more than welcome, uh, anyone who would like to come and join and learn about Rotary. Um, we have all kinds of projects running year-round. Uh, there are always many needs in the community. So uh, please, if you would uh, like us, we're in the phone book, uh, or come out to one of our meetings. We'd be more than, more than happy to welcome you. So. Okay, Dave. Now, what would you say to um, uh, kids locally who are involved in baseball in Chatham-Kent? You know what, I'd say what, Dave? I'd say, you know, kids, I know that this organization has over 400 kids, and I know I've, I've played since I was uh, six years old, and I still play as a 54-year-old. You know what, I'd say, you know what, kids? Enjoy the game. Don't take the game so serious. Have fun playing it. Just enjoy it because, you know what, it's, it's meant to be, it's a game. And, uh, I mean, play it hard, but enjoy it and, and have a lot of fun. That's what I recommend to you. Now, to get involved with the Rotary Club, contact the Rotary Club of Chatham-Kent. And if you want to get involved in baseball locally, get in touch with the Chatham Minor Baseball Association. For TV Coach Go, I'm Dave Parkinson.